Back live on the red carpet here at the Dicka and Jaws Cigars with the Stars Party. Pleased to be joined by Mike Golick. Mike, how you doing tonight? I'm doing well. I'm, I'm part of the cigars part, not the stars part. Okay. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> I think you are a star because a lot of people see you on ESPN every day. But uh, talking about this event, what brings you out? And uh, we, we talked a little bit about, of course, the charities and Gridiron Greats. But what brings oh, you out tonight? I, 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 I've come out because, you know, uh, uh, Jaws and, and Dicka are great friends of mine. And obviously it's a fantastic cause for you know, all of us who have played the game and what, who they're trying to help and what they're trying to raise their money for. And by the way, it's one of the most popular parties every Super Bowl as well. It's the place to be. So even though there's an early wake-up call for in my, in my future, I, I certainly want to stop by and support as, as best I can. How about the whole city? They've been fantastic so far. We've been here, of course, we work here, but the Bay Area's been fantastic. What's the best part so far for you? It's, it's been great, quite honestly. The weather has been fantastic. It's getting better and better each day. You know, at times when you get downtown, it seems crowded, but then it kind of opens up. There, though, so gridlock hasn't been bad at all. Now, of course, we got the weekend to get into and such. But and everybody has been very accommodating. Very, accom- I mean, there's been no issues at all. I mean, a, a very friendly city. So it's been fantastic. Best person you've seen so far this week, of course, via work or a pleasure, of course. You, you well. know who I've been hanging out with? I actually flew in with, and then I saw him here as well. And when I grew up. Now, I'm from Cleveland, so I hated this team. You had When you're from Cleveland, you have to hate the Pittsburgh Steelers. But Franco Harris, I've been hanging out. It, it, it blew my mind. I'm just, and he, we're just chatting like, like nothing, and I'm like, wow, it's Franco Harris. I mean, listen, I know I played in the league and all that, but I, I'm, still, I, I'm still you know, in awe of these, of these legends like that. So it was really cool to just hang out and talk to him like, like a normal person. And, of course, the first thing I asked him is, did the ball hit the ground? And, he didn't really want to answer that. <laughs> <laughs> who wins this Sunday, Panthers, Broncos? Who you got? I, I think, you know, the I don't have, obviously have a horse in the race. The nostalgia would say if it's going to be Peyton's last game, I'd like to see him win. I think Carolina's the better team, and I think they win. I, the score I'm going with is about 27-17. I think Carolina wins it. Fair enough, sir. Appreciate your time, you Mike. No problem. Thank you very much. Enjoy your night. Thanks. That is Mike Golick, ladies and gentlemen. You see him live, ESPN's Mike and Mike, every day of the week, live on the Cube.